guys, what's going on? And welcome to the latest from 616 Games, Tales Beyond the Tomb, Pineville Night Stalker. So it looks like this is 616's take on the Fears to Fathom style games. It uses your microphone and some other cool things. But if you do enjoy the video, please make sure to like and subscribe and welcome to the full gameplay of Tales Beyond the Tomb, Pineville Night Stalker. My name is Megan. I graduated from law school two years ago. Since then, I've been working in a small office in downtown New York. My mother passed away two months ago. We didn't have a particularly close relationship. To be honest, it had been six years since we had last seen each other. This morning, I received a message from a lawyer who told me that I had to go to the town of Pineville to sign the will. I've asked my boss for three days leave so that I can sort this out quickly. My work colleague, Lenny, is on vacation and has offered to accompany me. Today I had to stay at the office. I had to close some cases before I went traveling. In the end, I fell asleep. Damn! I fell asleep without meaning to. In the office, nonetheless. Good morning! Where is my coworker? Somebody's been smoking a little something over here. I have to pee. I'm about to burst. That means somebody's here. Someone was here recently. Hmm. What time is it? Do we have a... I hear a clock. It's, uh, three o'clock in the morning. Jeez. All right. My name is Megan. Better close the door first. Okay. Hold F to P. Almost done. Ah, much better. All right, let's get back to... Are we getting back to work or are we going home? Oh, I better wash my hands. That's a good point. Something gonna pop up in that mirror? No. Look at that stream of water. That is a stream of water. That's a real good stream of water. We got that shit on cold. Damn, Meg, you scared me. Did I scare you? Damn, Lenny, you almost killed me. I'm sorry. I just came to get some papers and I had to go to the toilet. I didn't want to wake you. Uh, from the smell, you isn't like rotten, right? I just put a smile around. I don't think so, right? Ah, uh, very funny. We better go now. It's getting late. Lenny, isn't Lenny supposed to be accompanying me on vacation? And by vacation, I mean signing my mother's will because she died. I'm not leaving yet. All right, what are you doing then? Turn your computer off, probably close the windows, do that kind of stuff. We talk, you want to talk to Lenny? My dear colleague, could you help me in a fo find a folder? Uh, what would you do without me? That's why I love you, Meg. It's a folder with a red cover. It has a label with my name on it. With your name? What, which one is it? The bathroom destroyer? That's so funny, I had a stomach, don't judge me. Let's find this folder quickly, it's already too late. All right, I'll look around here. Could you check cupboards? Sure. Which covers these? Red folder. How about blue? That's about the best I can do for you here. What of these? Red fo Oh, red folder. This is definitely the folder. I found it, Lenny, you stupid fuck. Here it is. You're badass. I know. Who still uses this tasteless slang? How are you? I mean, about everything. Are you ready to go tomorrow? Yeah, I'm fine. Thanks for coming with me. No problem. You're my best friend, you idiot. Best friend. Hmm. That nickname won't last. Now I must go. You consume my intelligence. Uh, let's go soon. Extension of the soon the whole building. He's not loving that joke. It's kind of overdone. It's okay. Lenny, it's okay. All right. Off to... Sign my mother's will. Is that what I'm doing? Signing my mother's will? I think so, isn't it? 
Let us just see here. Uh, bus stop. Where'd Lenny go? Oh, he's right here. It's so dark, Lenny. You wanna get some good food? You wanna get some, uh, I have to go. Can you manage here alone? Yeah, no problem. Just a, just a girl out here alone, no problem. If you want on your way to your bus arrives. No, fuck off, Lenny. I don't know, it's late at night. Uh, crazy birds might be chasing you. Ah, very funny, you can go. I'm fine. Uh, so see you later. Take care of yourself. All right. Where's he going? You take care of yourself too, Lenny. You probably need me more than I need you. I'm gonna sit down. I hope it doesn't take too long. Where are you gonna sit down at? Uh, there's a bench here, maybe? Yeah, there we go. Okay, well, I hope the bus pulls up sometime soon. I don't know. Not really much to do out here. It's quiet and boring. There's, uh... Is that it? It's a big fuck off trash truck. What are those things called? Garbage truck. Try not trash truck. <laughs> Stupid. What's going on? Who's this guy? Lenny, big bald guy approaching. Three o'clock here. All right. No problem. Never mind. He's cool. He's cool. I was just profiling a little bit. That's on me. That's on me, Lenny. Yeah. That's on me. Okay. Uh. Can I stand up? Wait. Lenny, I might have been right about the profiling thing. He's uh, he's come to a stop now, quite close to me. He's turning around, Lenny. He is turning around. Big bald guy wearing a, wearing a jacket. He's walking by me, quite slow. Uh, okay, maybe. Lenny, I might have been wrong. Might have been profiling again. Sorry, I don't know. Oh, Lenny, you might have been right. He stopped again. He's looking at me here. Yeah, I think I was right. Uh, okay. I'm gonna shit my pants. Oh. Look at that, he's gonna come. Hey, brother, there's like four other seats there. You really don't have to sit in that one right next to me. That's really no, no need for that at all. Uh, it's not that I'm, I don't know, like, Can we stand up? I don't really. You gonna say something? Obviously you're doing some fuck shit. You gonna, you gonna say something about it? It's a beautiful night. Nowadays people live without regard for others. Yeah, I'd say the same thing about you sitting right next to me. Bruh, not really regarding my Dude, stand up and go and leave. Why would we continue to sit here? There's no reason that we would continue to sit here. I. No problem. So, uh. How about those Dodgers, huh? I mean, I know it was a couple weeks ago, but. You're a very beautiful young woman. You should not be on the street this time of night. I like the night in this cooler climate. Perfect. You're right. It's not good to talk to a stranger. Can you please leave me alone? Oh, of course. I'm sorry. I'll leave you in peace. Weird ass. Bro, this bus gotta be out of here, right? Come on. I can't sit here any longer. The, t the tension that's rising between the two of us is just... It's just too much. Can we? Look at that fucking schnoz on your face, dude. Sorry. Okay. You're right. You're right. I'm chilling. I will uh, sit here and wait for the bus to arrive. I will mind my own business. No problem. Oh. Just kidding. Just kidding. Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. Just kidding. What a strange fellow. Glad he's leaving. 
So am I. Super weird. There, brother. That was weird. That was really weird. I really thought it was weird. Kind of drug it on for too long. Uh. Oh, that's me. That's me holding W. That's those footsteps. Those aren't real footsteps. Bro, the. It's too slow. Nothing's happening. Can we. Can we we should just speed it up a little here. Maybe this is me just having a hard time sitting still for a long time, but nothing's happening here. Come on, man. I'm gonna fall asleep. Rightfully so. Most exciting thing of the night has been that bald fuck. And he left. That man really scared me. I don't know what he wanted. There are people who sometimes just want attention. I bus arrived and I went home. I was very tired. I've arranged to meet Lenny in the morning. He has a motorhome. I hope the bathtub doesn't get damaged by the on the way. It's time to return to Pineville, the place where I spent my childhood. Tales Beyond the Tomb, Pineville Night Stalker. Was that just the intro to the game? Thursday, October 24th, 2017, 9.35 p.m. I like the music. We traveled all day, the road stretching endlessly before us. Heavy rain poured down, slowing us down a bit. It was still a long way to Pineville. Lenny's a really cool guy. I wouldn't have come without him. Lenny's chill like that. Hope he remains chill like that. Oh look, he's even driving me. What are, we, what are we, what vehicle are we in? Lenny's like three business days away from me. What are we driving? Big ass truck or something. Do you think there's life beyond Earth? Like, do you believe in aliens? I'm not really sure. I think I might, but I've never thought about it too deeply. Uh, what about you? Do you believe in it? Absolutely. I mean, universe is infinite. Seems impossible that we're alone in it. Uh, looks like we have a philosopher in the car. Wow. Yeah. And it's still very beautiful. Me or you? What the? What you be talking about? Eyes on the road, please. I no rush, no worries, no problem. It's all good. It's all good. You wanna say something? No. Hey yo, what's up with the uh windshield wipers in this vehicle that we're driving? Why are they you know stuck in the middle like that? Oh, I've never seen a road like this straight in, this straight in my life. I really like it. it. Brings me a sense of peace. I really needed this trip. Being cooped up in the office is driving me nuts. Same here. It's nice to escape the city noise. Let's stop at the next gas station to refuel. Looks good. I get something to drink. All right. Stopping at a gas station. Strangers approaching us at the bus stop. This is checking all of the boxes here. Did you hear that noise? Noise? I didn't hear a thing. What'd you hear, Lenny? Jesus Christ, Lenny. This guy's a... All right, stop it at the gas station. I could really just drink. After what you put me through, probably of the alcoholic sort. Bruh, what are we yielding for a car seven miles away? Jeez. Was that the smallest car in the history of the world? Did you see how small that was? Did you see how small that thing was? Micro, man. Oh my god, there's some arcade games out there. Let me out. Let me out. Are they? Oh, they are covered. All right. It's kind of weird to have an arcade game outside, but... Lenny's not breaking any speed records. That's for sure. Jesus Christ. Can I get out of the car? I'm really interested to see what uh, sort of vehicle we're driving here. Ah! Oh, feels so good to breathe in the mountain air. Ah. Oh, come on, man. You should a little far. Oh my god, I need some fresh air. I'm gonna grab something to drink. My legs are really numb. I'll just stay here. Alright, I'll be back in a minute. Can you grab me an energy drink? Thanks. Sure, but you're paying. I thought we were best friends. Fine walls in the back. Um. Right, okay. Okay, so, uh. Legs are numb, but you're staying in the car? 
Oh my god, we're in a we're in a camper. I need to get Lenny's wallet. He said it's in the back. Back in here. Oh, that makes sense. It's kind of cozy in here. All right. That's why it's that's why it's so big. I, I didn't realize that we were hungry snake. Oh my god, you can actually play the game. No, nah, I'm not playing snake. Not today. Okay, we need one energy drink. Wait. Good evening. How's the journey going? Uh, good evening. Everything's great. It's nice to get it done sometimes. That's great to hear. Where are you headed? Headed to Pineville. I was born there. It's a tiny town, but I know there's some really beautiful houses there. My mother passed away. I'm going there to take care of you things. I'm really sorry to hear that, Mike Knowles. Thank you. That's really kind of you. Do you need anything else or is it just a fuel? I'll take two energy drinks, please. Energy drinks are in the voting machine on the left. Thank you. I love that. I love telling a random person that my mother died. Congratulations. Give me one more, please. And there's one. All right, one more now. She probably loved that interaction. I thought there was an arrow above her head. It's a, it's a lamp. All right. And here is two, two energy drinks. Thank you. Have a good day. Sorry about the trauma dump. You forgot to pay. I'm sorry. I'm just so tired. <laughs> oh, okay. Uh, oh, oh, wait. Oh, we are going to pay still. Two dark energy drinks and fuel. Do you need anything else? Nope, that's it. The total is $60. Here it is. Thank you. Have a safe trip. 60. Oh, fuel, fuel, fuel. Did you forget something? Energy drinks. I'm so distracted. Jesus. I don't know. I had to pick them up. Sorry about that. Uh, it's really been a day. Anyways, I'll we'll see you later. Good night. Hey, Lenny. Here's your energy drink, Lenny. Thanks, Meg. Really needed that. We need to find a place to stay for the night. There's a motel nearby. Maybe we stay there and take a hot shower. Uh, perfect. Let's finish our energy drinks. Hit the road. Yes, ma'am, Captain. Crack that open. Two dark energy drinks. Mmm. Tasty. All right, let's, uh... Is there a trash can out here? What's this? This is just a bucket, I think. What is that? Is that a trash can? Wear protective gloves. All right, Lenny, you ready? I mean, I can drink mine on the road, so... so that's that. You finish yours up, though. I mean, you could drink yours on the road, too, if you... All right. You know what? I'll sit out here and do what I need to do. Let me inquire. That was really refreshing. Really? Let's go now. We sit here in the motel. How about we make a bet? If I can throw this can of the bucket, you pay for the motel. You would make a mistake even if the bucket was on your side. Aha! You're gonna lose. I was a basketball champion in school. Yeah, it's been a really long time. Free motel, hot shower, I'm coming. Go ahead then, bitch ass. Shoot that shit. Shoot that shit, bruh! Stupid fucking idiot. Let me make mine, though. Ha ha ha! You gotta pay for everything and I'm gonna enjoy it. That's not fair. The wind got in my way. No, suck my dick. You lost. Okay, okay. I'm gonna keep some promises. Let's go. I'm already looking forward to a hot shower. You think that's funny, don't you? Throw garbage on the ground. Calm down, my friend. We're only joking. We don't want to leave trash on the ground. Yeah, we're just joking. Damn people from the big city. Always causing trouble. Ruin everything. You're rude as fuck, bro. We done nothing. Forget it, Meg. Let's go. It's not worth arguing, man. Let me throw mine on the ground, too. Just kidding. Just kidding. Let's get a move on, Lenny. That's awkward. We well, were going to pick it up, bro. I'm not, I'm, not, I'm not out here trying to litter. It's not like that. We're going to pick it up 100%, man. To the motel we go. All right. Friday, October 25th, 2017. 1.25 a.m. October 25th, 1.25 a.m. What was it? Yes, it was the 24. We finally arrived at the motel. I need to take a hot shower and rest. Tomorrow morning, we'll continue our journey. We should arrive in Pineville at dusk. It's going to be traveling with Lenny, but it's a little weird. I know he likes me, but I only see him as a friend. Oh, oh, it's like that. 
I didn't know it was like that. I still have Lenny's wallet in my inventory. Where am I? Hey, yo, I can't see anything. Lenny, what's up? Finally made it to motel. I could fall asleep right here just sitting. Oh, I do reception. I still have your wallet with me. You could just get one room. It'll save us some money and we can crash together. Hopefully the bed's big enough. You really don't give up, do you? I'm a warrior and you're my maiden. All right, you want to sign war? Go ahead and get two rooms. Man, bro. Right. I'm getting two rooms. Motel. At this place, I'm getting two rooms for sure. Oh, the office is here. Be right back, Lenny. Rand Rock. What is it? Crand. Crand Rock. What up? Welcome to the Grand Motel. Rock Hope. Mo Welcome to the Grand Rock Motel. Best motel in the whole region. Uh, good evening. Need two rooms. Two rooms. Are you accompanied? Yeah, friends outside. Perfect. How long will you stay? Tonight only. Tomorrow morning we must go. Where are you going? You don't look like you're from around here. We're going to Pineville. Family matters. Very cool. Young people traveling and enjoying life. Ah, uh, I miss my younger days. Yeah, well, you're old as fuck. Can you give me the key, please? Of course. Sometimes I talk too much. Cost twenty-two fifty per room, including breakfast. Perfect. Twenty-two fifty plus breakfast. God damn. Thanks. I'll get the keys for you. Twenty-two fifty plus breakfast, bro. <sighs> coffee. I don't want coffee right now. That makes sense. It is quite late. Thank you. Rooms one and four. You're in luck. Those are the only two that aren't book. Wow. Thank you. My son works here with me. If you see him, just ignore him. He's a good kid. He just has some mental problems. Uh, no problem. I just want to take a hot shower and sleep. Good night, beautiful young lady. Dream sweetly. Thanks. Beautiful young lady. Dream sweetly. My son works around here. He just has some mental problems. But he's, he's chill, though. I got the shit, Lenny. Wait, where the fuck did he go? Why didn't he come in with me? What was he doing? Room's one and four. He must be waiting for me at the thing. Oh, he's out of here. Dancing around in the middle of the parking lot. Why didn't he come with me? All right, Lenny. I rented two rooms. Two? I oh, already sleep together. Shut the fuck up! Okay, no kidding. Can I stay in room one? Keep an eye on the motorhome. All right. I'll see you tomorrow. Night, Lenny. Night, Lenster. I'm headed to room four. One, two, three, four. Another arcade machine here. All right. Sleep good, brother. Because that's what I see you as. I really need to pee. We should probably lock this up, no? What's this? Television. Oh, this place is pretty nice. 2250, not bad. There we go. Better close the door first. True. I don't know why, but true. Okay, so of the 30 minutes that we've been playing this game, 20 of it has been peeing. That's pretty realistic, I guess. There we go. Lit. Lit. Time to go. Time to go to bed, actually. Better wash my hands, too. Okay, can we go to bed? I'm tired. Fuck. I'm gonna take a shower before... Oh, my God. Okay, okay, okay. Take a shower. Then. Go ahead. I wanna close all the doors first. shower why does it sound like somebody's walking around in here I don't bathe take your time it might have just been me walking around I don't know I could definitely like hear the sound of some footsteps but maybe it was I don't know I might just be hearing things okay okay it's good. Have you done enough? Can I go to bed, please? Tired. Someone knocking on the door. It's probably just Lenny's bitch ass. This I. We have the people, don't we? I don't not leave now. No, check the check the check the people. I don't want to leave. I want to check the people, bitch ass. Lenny? Oh, it's not Lenny. It kind of looks like Lenny. Uh, where are you? What do you want? Please get out of here. Please let me in. My mother's angry with me. Fuck you and fuck your mother too. You cannot enter. 
I'm Jeremiah. Now you know me. Let me in. Uh, no. I'll open this fucking door now. If you don't leave, I'll call the police. Do you no longer love me? I love you. I said leave. Uh, that's kind of weird, bro. Get the fuck on out of here now. Go on. Oh, we got that shit locked for sure, right? What does he want from me? He must be the son of the motel. Oh. That's so true. That's so true. 2250 a room. It's okay. We can put up with a weird kid for 2250. Think about it. Think about it that way. We're saving a lot of money doing this. Is he still walking around out there? Oh. Music is my life. All right, go get on now. Maybe I should have stayed with Lenny. Oh my god. Do not knock on my door again. Let's go to bed, dude. He's whistling outside the door. Oh my god. Brother, I said to leave, man. For real, go. Oh. What do we want to do about this? He's trying to get in. I need to hide. Where the fuck are we gonna hide at? Can you close this? The bathroom? Can we lock it? I don't know where to hide at. Where am I gonna hide, bruh? What is that? The bathroom? In here, in here, in here. Oh. I found you now, it's your turn to look for me. Get out or I'll scream again. <laughs> but I just wanted to play. You were hiding and I thought you wanted to play too. Playing? You broke into my room. You're very beautiful. I've never seen such a beautiful woman. Never. Hey, thank you. What do you think about playing something else just like me and mom? Mom plays with me in bed. That's the... What the fuck are you say? Jeremiah. This again? What did I tell you about breaking into other people's rooms? Mom, I was only joking. She wasn't even scared. No excuses. Go home now, or you will learn not to disrespect me anymore. I'm so sorry about that. He must have forgotten to take his medication. That won't happen again. I don't give a fuck if he took his medication. Why, if he's if he's like that, why does he have keys to get in the room, ma'am? Jesus Christ. This is not good. Yes, I told you he has some problems, but I promise you he won't come near you again. Shut the fuck. Just get, just, just go. Have a nice evening. If you need me, I'll be at reception. Aw. Oh. If I come in a reception, you're not gonna be wanting to see me. Trust me, it's gonna be the last thing you see. <laughs> just kidding. I'm not. I am kind of. Jesus Christ. Having this conversation outside of the closet. Insane. How am I meant to go to bed now? Maybe I should go talk to Lenny. Maybe I should go tell Lenny I want to stay in his room. I, you know, I don't like this shit. God damn. I'm talking about hide and seek. I'm sat in there holding my breath for four and a half minutes. What's in here? I better get free coffee tomorrow and a refund. Can I? Let's go talk to Lenny. After that, I need to drink coffee. There's a coffee machine at the reception. Why don't we go talk to Lenny? I want to stay with him. 
this is not my room. No, it's Lenny's room, but whatever. All right, let's go get a coffee at the reception. Tell that lady how much I hate her and her son. I'm talking about hide and seek. Yeah, I just give my son keys to uh get into everyone's room. Weird ass. All right, give me uh give me give me a uh, coffee and milk. Cafe con leche, please. Thank you. Uh, thank you. One ninety nine. Oh, cappuccino. Uh, cappuccino. Yeah, I want a cappuccino. Mmm. Thank you. Thank you. All right. All right. A coffee at one. This is so fucking stupid. Why am I drinking a coffee at 1.30 in the morning after that? The dumbest thing I've ever seen in my entire life. Back in the room. God! Which one is that? Are you okay? Who's that guy? It's Lenny. Okay, okay. All right, Lenny. Uh, it's it's fine. He's just the yeah, apeshit crazy. Seems like there are only crazy people out there, right? Yeah, I almost wet my trousers with fear. Damn. I think we need to sleep. We'll be back on the road in a few hours. You're right. I almost fell asleep standing up. When the madman returns, scream. I'll come and save you. And how you save me. Ah, uh, very funny, but seriously, just shouting up here. All right, I'm fine. Don't worry. If you want to sleep here with you, that'd be safer. So you just show the bathroom in my room? No. You never forget this way. Wait, no, I kind of want Lenny to stay here, though. Fine. Can we go to sleep, dude? This has been the longest day of my life. Can we please go to sleep? Oh, please. No worries if not. I need to sleep. I'm very tired. This is your fault for fucking around for the last hour. I don't know. Close my eyes, go to bed, good night. <sighs> Hello? Betty update here? It's still on, it feels like I slept for two minutes. You did sleep for two minutes in real time. Seriously. Let's get out of bed. Well, I'm glad that we made it through the night. It's good to see this place during the daytime. I am not going to lie. I don't think I've ever seen a black toilet before. It's pretty cool. It's kind of lit. Deer. Game from 616 Games. That's a good one. Played that one before. Let me go see what Lenny's doing. Something feels off. Feels like this is maybe a dream or some sort. Some. This is not my room. No, I know. It's Lenny's room. Lenny must still be sleeping. I'm going to make some coffee. All right. More coffee. How about some water? Maybe we should get some water. It's pretty out here. Look at that. Twin mountains. They look basically the exact same. That must be some sort of natural phenomenon. Let's get a... Uh, let's get a... Uh, let's get a coffee. Let, let's do a strong coffee gonna be a long day we got a long trip ahead of us probably should get something a little bit strong there we go how did people wake up before they had alarm clocks in the morning what are, what are like you were supposed to be at work at 7 30 in the morning but you didn't have an alarm clock and then you slept through it how'd you how do you do that i'll leave it to drink on the road i need to wake lenny up oh now you want to do that all right there we go Lenny, it's time to go, brother. Lenny, wake up, bro. We're going to be late. Jesus, bro. By the time you got done getting ready, my dad died too. Just kidding. Good morning, sleepyhead. Are you awake? You ready to go again? Don't you want to drink some coffee? No, I drink coffee in the morning. Say my stomach doesn't feel very good. Uh, yeah, we better get going then. We have all day till we arrive. Come on, be careful your new friend. He was around in the early hours of the morning. Very strange. Yeah, that mad guy kind of scared me. He's just a guy who needs attention. Sure. Sure you don't want a coffee, Lenny? 
It's on... Not me. Wait, we didn't even get our... We had free breakfast. Where do they serve breakfast at at this place, though? I think they're lying. Look at this big fuck-off RV. That is the biggest camper RV thing I've ever seen in my entire life. Ooh. Tales Beyond the Tomb, Pineville Night Stalker, part five. All right. Friday, October 25th, 2017, 9.25 a.m. I had never been on such a long trip. We drove for a few more hours and decided to stop for something to eat. I hope I don't need any, meet any more crazy people out there. It seems like everyone is always hostile and dangerous. Let's stroll. What are you doing, bro? I'm starving. Seems like a good place to get something to eat. Uh, me too. This is our last stop before Pineville. Choose Taylor or sit up. I'll be there in a minute. minute. And why don't you come right now? I'm getting old, man. I just need a minute so my back doesn't lock up. Okay. I'll wait for you inside, old man. I hope Lenny is, is uh, chill. Is that a goddamn horse? Lenny, bro, they got a horse over. Whatever. Uh. Good morning, young lady. Welcome to the best restaurant in the whole region. Uh, good morning. What do you recommend I order? Our burgers are famous. Order one of the fries. You can't go wrong. Thank you. Okay, I'm gonna. I'm gonna sit in a booth. Right here. This uh, this is good. Okay, Lenny. Hi, would you like something to eat? Yeah, just waiting for my friend. Okay, when he arrives, I'll come back to take your order. Would you like something to drink all day? Uh, no, no, thank you. Where's Lenny? He's not in... Oh, is that Lenny? Is he wearing a cowboy hat? What the fuck is bro doing? Is that Lenny? He walking in a cowboy hat? Hey, Lenny, what's up? What the fuck are you doing, man? What's up with the, what's with the outfit? So what do you think? Like my hat? Who do you think you are, Indiana Jones? Well, that's just Sam, a country guy now, traveling with my beautiful wife. Come on, Lenny, lose that. You're not a cowboy, and I'm also not your wife. Leave my hat alone. It's part of me now. Anyway, I'm starving. Let's order some. Good idea. I was ready to order something a couple minutes ago, by the way, but. Okay, we're ready. Hello, can I take your order? I want a burger and fries. All right, what about you, cowboy? What are you gonna have? Oh, the same as her, at a soda, please. Okay, do you need anything else? That's all, thank you. All right, I'll bring your order in just a bit. Thank you. So what do you think, Lenny? We, uh, I hope the food's good. Yeah, me too. You really like that hat, right? Yeah, that's how I look. That's how I look like a country boy. I mean, no one here is wearing a hat. This guy's got a beanie on, but that's true. But I'll still wear my hat. All right. I'll give up. Yeah, I do appreciate a guy that can, uh, you know, stick up for what he believes in. Wearing it, whether it's wearing a hat or, you know, ketchup. Anything like that. No way that's our order. Really? Ma'am, incredibly quick delivery. Here's your order, bon appetit. If you need anything, just call me. Thank you. Mm. Oh my God, I'm so hungry. Oh my God, I'm so hungry. What do you think, Lenny? Usually you open your mouth when you eat, but that's okay. Yeah. Okay. Do it again. <laughs> I have a stomach ache. Well, I quickly ate it. I'm not surprised. I'll just run to the bathroom real quick. Be right back. Okay. Uh, bathroom right here. Uh, if we stay in here long enough, uh, locked. Oh, this one's open. The other one's locked. Shit. If we stay in here long enough, Lenny, you'll have to pay for the for the for the food. So. Oh my gosh, that snack did not sit well with me. Don't. Let's 
Sounds like the 4th of July in here. What's going on? Nice sketchers, bro. Can I help you? Uh, hello? Goodbye. How come everybody's fucking weird around here? What's up with that? Everybody is. All just weird. So I tell Lenny about this. Where did Lenny go? What the hell? Uh, hey, did you see my friend? Can I walk outside? I thought you left without me. I was just over there talking to that horse. That burger messed me up. Well, you should probably leave soon before they figure out you're right in the bathroom. Uh, that's not funny. Let's go. Okay. Did you pay for the shit? I reckon you probably did, eh? Thanks, Lenny. Appreciate you, bro. Okay. I keep thinking Lenny's being weird and then he's actually not. So maybe Lenny's actually just kind of that guy. You know? Like a good guy. Maybe Lenny. Get ready to turn it up, Pineville. We're your best source for country hits in the region. Here comes another one that's gonna light up your day. Pine 105. We're in Pineville? Get ready to light it up, Pineville. Big right turn here, Lenny. Nice one, brother. What's this book you got there? Scripture? Book of Mormon? Pineville kind of gives those vibes, in it? All right, not in the mood to talk. I'll just keep talking to myself. I'm pretty good at that. You know, I actually kind of low-key do that for a living, if you really think about it. All right. Well, we're just going to park and occupy the entire fucking road. We finally arrived. Wow, this house is stunning. Must have at least 10 rooms. It's not the house in front, Lenny. Lenny, it's the one to the right. It's still a fantastic house. There's so many beautiful homes around here. Yeah, this city's beautiful. It'd be cool to live here. How are you, Meg? How do you feel after all this? Are, are you okay? Uh, it's kind of strange being here. Oh, I should park the motorhome now. The lawyer's probably waiting for you. You're right. I need to talk to him soon. Okay. I kind of forgot what we were doing. So much has happened in the meantime. Kind of just been followed around by creepy people everywhere that we've went. First it was that guy at the motel, then it was the guy at the restaurant. And then Lenny also. Is that the lawyer? Why is he just sat in my mom's house? That's kind of weird, isn't it? Why is he 12? Hello, you must be Megan. Yeah, it's me. You must be Henry. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm truly sorry for your loss. Uh, pre pleasure's all mine. Thank you. I apologize for making you come this way. Uh, it's crucial that you take responsibility for your inheritance. Otherwise, the state will auction off your mother's house and belongings. I was very close to my mother, uh, but I am her only daughter. I just need you to sign a few papers tomorrow afternoon. I'll give you the deed to the house. Great. Uh, so tomorrow we can return home. I noticed you didn't come by yourself. Did you bring your boyfriend? Uh, he's not my boyfriend. Uh, uh, can I just sign the papers? So let's get started. Just need your autograph. Ha 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 ha. Uh, I just need to use the bathroom first. I'm about to burst. Uh, certainly. Come on in. It's your home. Thanks. Oh, she says you would want to live here. Why don't we just... Nice television. Better not walk around the house yet. Where's the bathroom? Upstairs? Uh, there's no stairs. First door on the right. You're familiar with the house, aren't you? Uh, I've been your mother's lawyer for quite a while. We had a good relationship. Okay. Take your time. I'll be here waiting. Weird. Not a good relationship, bro. He literally looks like he's 12 years old. Fuck. All right. More, more pissing. It's time for some more pissing in the piss simulator. 
One hour into the piss simulator. There you go. All right. Wait, do I need to wash my hands or? Good practice. It's good practice, even if you don't have to. Okay. There are only two signatures required. One for the deed to the house and the other for access to the bank accounts. Yeah, I know. I'm a lawyer too. A professional colleague. Why didn't you bring that up sooner? Doesn't change anything. I'm here as your daughter. All right, just go ahead and sign the documents. Okay. Excellent. That's all. I'll stop by tomorrow afternoon and give you the house deed. I uh, really appreciate it. I need to get some rest now. Hey, you had to be Megan's friend, right? Lenny here, hello, brings to mind a convention for attorneys. Ah, it's true. All we needed was one more judge to complete the Fantastic Quartet. Well, Lenny, it seems you made a new friend. Seems someone's feeling jealous, huh, Meg? No, you love, know that I love you. Just be quiet, not to talk nonsense. I left myself a number on the refrigerator door. I need to go. Call me if you need anything at all. Uh, don't worry, after just one hour with Lenny, you'll be ready to pull your hair out. Isn't that right, Lenny? You drive everyone up the wall. I know that I need to use the bathroom right away. Bathroom situated upstairs on the second floor of the first floor on the right. Thank you, man. I'm about to run her. Crap my pants. There he goes. Up the stairs, hand in the rail and all. Uh, he can be a bit odd. I get it. Okay, I need to go now. Goodbye. Got it. See you tomorrow, Henry. Oh, maybe he's having a sleepover with us. Oh, that's why I was telling him I was tired, because that was me nicely telling him to get the fuck out of the house. I see. I see what's going on. All right. Okay. Well, we signed the shit. We did what we needed to do. Maybe it's time to go now. 8 p.m. Time for... Home? Maybe. Time for... To leave, maybe? I don't know. I've never seen a night city this beautiful. Sometimes I want to live far away. I've never I've never seen a night this beautiful. Someday I want to live far away from the city. I don't know. I guess I actually like the big city. Not sure I'd ever get used to that kind of quiet. Though I gotta admit, taking a break from the usual routine feels really nice. So, what are you planning to do? I mean, with the house, are you thinking about moving here? I haven't really thought about it yet. A uh, lot to take in. I really like it here. Just promise me one thing you won't ditch your best friend who, in this case, it's me. Uh, yeah, thanks again for coming with me, Lenny. I know you love me. You don't need to hide it anymore. I'm not even going to dignify this with an answer. I've always wondered what it would be like to, ha uh, to like, have a relationship like that, where you're, like, you know, friends with somebody, but they, like, are indeed like that, but you're not into them like that. It's... Did you know the moon moves away from the Earth every year? Lenny and his random affairs. Uh, it's serious, but it won't affect us. At least until the entire solar system ends. Where do you get these things from? I read tons of books. Oh, I'm a very smart guy. Okay, that's a lie. I just Googled it. Uh, not everything you see on the internet is true, you know. I know, but you gotta get with the time spec. It's 2017, and you don't even have a cell phone. You know, I can't stand technology. All this talk's making me hungry. What's well, gonna eat in the city? Maybe there's pizza pizzeria nearby. Uh, it'd be perfect. I haven't eaten pizza for a long time. Must be a telephone in the house. Look for a flyer, the number of pizzeria. I need to take a shower. All right, Lenny, go take a shower. I'll do the work myself. Please, Meg, I'm so tired. Okay. Thank you, beautiful woman. As for pepperoni or lots of onion, I'll pay. Now you're speaking my language. You'll pay? All right. I'm good for that. I'm good for that. Mm. Thank you. All right. How do I, um, how am I looking for that? Okay, you need to find the phone number of a pizzeria. Well, here's Henry's number. Where do I find the phone number of a pizzeria at? Is that a pizza box? 555914. Delivery. Okay. That's kind of morbid. My mom's pizza box, who's, by the way, dead. 555914. Where's the phone at? Uh... Does the phone still work? Flashlight, can I take that? Well, I found the, f I found the pizza box, but how do I, how do I call now? 
I mean, I need to just join the bathroom. Okay, but where's the phone? Oh, computer. Password. Okay, doesn't just type it for me. Fuck. Okay. Uh, let's see if something around here tells me what the uh, thing is. I don't think so. Something in here, maybe? Book. Did I make this into those security cameras? Uh, I'm a little uncomfortable. Uh, it's tiring. I don't care. Computer password is 175548. Okay. 175548. Thank you. 175548. It's not typing. 175548. Login. Not shut down. snake monitoring system explorer no internet access are you sure all cameras activated right mode change cam that's kind of creepy what is that nah see because when, when i look at these cams i just try and imagine things you know why would i be looking at the cams anyways though it's the internet meter I need to order the pizza, but I don't know how. I mean, I found the phone number. I just don't see a phone to order the pizza with. Maybe it's somewhere in here. Now that I know I can turn the lights on, it might be a little easier to find it. But I, I mean, I found the, uh, I found the light box or the, the box. I just can't find the phone or anything. There it is. Five, 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 nine, one, four. 911 for emergencies. He didn't know that. Thanks for calling Pizza Romana. How can I help you? Ah, good evening. I'd like two large pizzas. Well, then you called the right place. <laughs> so, what kind of pizza do you want? <laughs> Pepperoni. That's a great choice. Meat and onion. Perfect. Do you want something to drink to help you cool off in this heat? It's fucking like midnight. Okay. And uh, what's your address? It's uh. It's like your total for delivery is eighty-seven fifty. Will you be needing change? Eighty-seven? Uh, yeah. Bring change for hundred. I'm not paying for it, but Jesus. Perfect. Your order should be arriving in thirty minutes. Thank you for being a customer of Romana Pizzeria. Bon appetit, and you have a good night. Thanks, bruh. Eighty-seven dollars. Oh, I feel like a new person. Were you able to order the pizza? Yeah, it should arrive here in thirty minutes. I'm so hungry. I gotta eat a dinosaur. Dinosaurs don't exist, Lenny. Don't you want to take a shower, man? You're starting to smell. Okay, well, right now you can go. When the pizza arrives, I'll take it. You better not eat without me. Don't worry, Mac. I'd never do that. All right. Uh, I was eighty-seven bucks, by the way. Must be the best pizza in the eighty-seven dollars, bro. Jesus. All right. Time to bathe. Ah, the lovely water stream again. We find ourselves in the same situation in which we've been finding ourselves all night, bathing, pissing, eating, driving, showering. Bathing, pissing, eating, showering, driving, pissing. Can we get out of here? Thank you. All right. Let's see if Lenny got the pizza. Hey, Lenny. Where's the pizza at, brother? Where the fuck is he? Is he in the living room? Maybe? Lenny, what the fuck, bro? Where's the pizza at, man? What's he doing? He chilling upstairs? Where's he gone now? Oh, good God. Damn, Meg, you always scare me. Am I scaring you? Are you serious? Relax, I was just using the phone. I called our boss. Uh, why did you call him? 
You know, Scott well. He never lets us take a real vacation. Uh, yeah, what does he want from you? He wants me to go to the nearby town of Pineville. He wants me to get some papers for him. You really want to leave me here alone, Lenny? It'll only be for a few hours. I'll be back before dawn, I promise you that. You're an idiot. But of course I won't leave until I've eaten pizza. I won't leave everything for you. Looks like our pizza's arrived. Can you get it? Sure. I, maybe Lenny is weird. I don't know. Like, what is he... No, he is... Maybe he is conspiring against us. What up, bruh? Cool tattoo, man. Thanks for the... Can I take it? Can I have it? Good evening. Pizza's here. I see that. I'm starving. Give it to me. Uh, where's Mrs. Judith? It's been a while since she appeared. Uh, yeah. My mother, uh, she fucking died. My condolences. My father passed away a month ago. I know how it is. Yeah, uh, yeah. I don't really care. Life is like this. One day we're here. Well, suddenly we die. Here are your pizzas. Have a nice evening. Yes, yeah, for change for a hundred, right? Yeah. Thank you. Hope you like pizza. It's the best in the whole region. I bet it'll be good. After all, that is pizza. Good night. See you later. Thank you. Good night. How come everyone says this is the best in the whole region here? Every every single place that we've gone has said it's the best in the whole region. It's the best in the whole region. I got the pizza, Lenny. He doesn't care. He's looking out the window. All right. Well, I'm going to eat it myself. Then I'm going to sit down and I'm going to have to shit myself. I don't have time for this shit no more. Mmm. Mmm. That looks great. This is pretty good, actually. Does look pretty good. Mmm. Yummy. Wow, that looks great. I can eat all by myself. That's selfish. All right, I'll give you two slices. Two slices are enough for me. I'm not a busy eating monster. A man must eat well. When we marry, you will have a very fat husband. Huh, why don't you shut the fuck up? How about eating this pizza while I watch TV? That's good with me. I'll turn it on since I know you're probably incapable. Figure out a way to figure out a way to increase production. Oh, there it is. Flood so soap incorporate. Look at that. Need a plate. Oh, there we go. Yummy. Okay. Oh, Lenny, I'm getting tired, brother. Oh, I'm getting so tired, Lenny. Okay. You uh eating that or shaving with it? Anyways. Good TV we're watching here, Lenny. I'm so tired of the word Lenny. I'm not saying it anymore. This is the best pizza I've ever eaten. I've eaten better, but it's very good. Alright, second round. Come on, whoever finished the last is a washing up. Let's go. Sounds like someone's locked on the door. Yeah, you can go there. I would go, but it's your house. Haha. <laughs> I don't have a lot of pain in my legs. You're such a monkey. Quiet. Okay. Take it with us, actually. Why not? Better put the blade in the sink. There's still a pizza on it. Okay. Oh! You are by far the ugliest fucking thing I've ever seen in my entire life. Uh, can I help you? I'm uh, sorry, it's just that you look a lot like Judith. Yeah, she's my mother. Uh, it's a pleasure to meet you. Uh, sorry, you're here. Uh, I live next door. By the way, my name is Joseph. Okay, my name's Megan. I'm sorry for her loss. She was an incredible woman. <laughs> Thanks, good night. Who's the man there with you? Just my friend. I'm calling. Looks like it's going to rain tonight. Uh, good evening. See you later then. If you need anything, I'm right here by your side. I'm in the house next door. He's like... Okay. I believe someone needed to wash dishes. You, I opened the door. By the way, it was that elderly man. Uh, Joseph, who lives next door. He knew my mother. They saw it out here in the countryside. People are far more talkative in the city. Everyone seems perpetually stressed. Uh, this is just everyone has a touch of psychopathy. It's true, but now we have to figure out how to wash dishes. Let's play a game over loses us to dishes. What game is it, Lenny? You can pick the game, I'll win regardless. Let's play a game of Taka. 
attack child's player. Right, let's do this. Work fine with an office. It's nice. Feel like child occasionally. All right, what are the rules? You can't leave the house. Uh, I'll run. If you catch me, all the dishes. If you give up trying to catch me, you'll end up doing the dishes. Just because my legs are hurt and you think you're going to win, huh? Come on, see if you can catch me if you dare. Let's go run. Slow ass. Wait a sec, though. Wait a sec, though. What the fuck, Lenny? That wasn't fair, bruh. All right. Go ahead and cry, but if I catch you again, you're on dish duty. All right. Okay. Let's see if I can get outside. What if I just run around this table infinitely? How you like that, Lenny, you stupid ass? Yeah, you can't catch me, bro. He's, he's hot on my tail, but he's not catching me. That's all that matters. He's not catching me. It would honestly almost be easier to just let him catch me at this point. He's not catching me. I think he's maybe supposed to catch me, but I figured out a way to not let him catch me. Because I'm lit like that. Come on, Lenny, bring your big ass over here. All right, I'll go to the couch. Can I go around the side? He cannot catch me. Lenny, give up, bro. Pack it up, bro. You lost. All right, that's enough. You lost. It's not fair, Lenny. You have to avenge your way faster than I am. Okay, I won't be unfair. Let's do this. I'll watch this bud uh, just this once. Then I really need to hit the road. If I don't get those papers, our boss will be furious. Oh, thanks for that. And for leaving me here all alone. Sorry, Meg. I promise I'll be back as soon as I can. <sighs> Hiding spot here. Probably have to use that later. Anything else we have that's worth anything? All right, so he's leaving me. And no doubt that elderly man's going to be coming back as soon as he leaves. Bye, Lenny. Lenny washed the dishes and turned to leave. Uh, I'll be back at dawn, I promise, he said with a reassuring smile. I have to admit, I really hate being here alone. It's so weird, kind of scary. My mother died in a really bizarre way. They found signs of strangulation. Someone killed her. Her body was found on the lawn, and no one, none of the neighbors saw or heard anything. And here I am. I still don't know what really happened. Alone at night in this house. Strange that we're just now mentioning that an hour and a half into this game. It is a little weird. It's 10.45 p.m. It's pouring. That old man was right. He said it was gonna rain. It's kinda cozy though. All right. I'm really parched. I need to grab, grab a glass of water. Uh, let's grab a glass of water then. Where's the, where the glass is at in here maybe? Oh, there we go. Look at that. Perfect. Come. I need some water too. Mm -hmm. <coughs> Throw feels much better now if I wasn't joking on it. <coughs> it's just water, I promise. You wouldn't think so. I just don't know how to drink. Okay. Put it in the sink. Come on now. I should probably put this cup in the sink now. I'm feeling sleepy. So I'm gonna lie down for a while. That's the bathroom. I'm gonna lie down right here. What time Lenny? Lenny said he'd be back before dawn. It's dawn and he's not back. Ooh, good night. 10.45. Sleepy. So sleepy. I wish it was 10.45. We're gonna be knocking at the door at this hour. I have an idea. It's either Lenny or that thumb man. That's my guess. That or that crazy dude from the motel followed us here. One of those three. If I was a betting man. Could you please help me? I really need it. Uh, who are you? My name is Fred. My car broke down nearby and I'm soaked. I'm sorry, but I'm not sure I can help. 
I really just need a towel to dry off, and if you could, could you use your phone to call a tow truck for my car? I can't help you right now. I'm sorry. Please, I've knocked on every door. No one answered you. My only hope. I'm sorry. I can't help. Are you kidding? I'm a real mess, and you're just going to turn me away? You're not going to say anything? Are you really just going to deny help to someone in need? I already told you I can't help. I'm sorry. Please go away. You'll pay for this. You don't know what you're doing. You're ugly. Why is everyone weird, dude? That's like the 20th weird encounter that we've had in really not that much time. Go back to bed. Wait, check the cams, actually. Am I gonna have to log back in? Yeah, fuck. Okay. Let me see what the code is. Somewhere in here in the room. It's like one set one something five seven four four eight or something like that. Where was it? It was on uh What is that thing? Why is there a big block right there now? This thing. One seven five five four eight. That was pretty close. One seven five five four eight. Let's have a look. Oh. You know what they say. Let me see something here. Right mode. He's still walking around out there. It's weird. It's really weird. Is that him right there standing there yet? Oh, he's walking away now. This other cam. It's not a. Uh... Wait, go to the next one though. It stopped. It doesn't work. Wait, this is not working. Oh. Okay. Is Lenny coming home? That really scared me. It feels like I only attract crazy people. I decided to let her go and get some sleep. I turned on the lights and lay down. I the fauna sleeps the sound of rain. It's soothing and refreshing. I can still smell my mother's perfume lingering in the room. I fell asleep at around 12.30 a.m. I heard some crazy noises coming from the garage. Good thing I'm already on the cams. It's literally the noises coming from the garage. I don't see anything on the cams. Of which I fell asleep on. Stand up, bruh! I think maybe I wasn't supposed to be on the computer. <laughs> Alright, let's go look at the garage. 175548, just in case. I should check the camera, so I'm gonna be. I'm ahead of the game. My brain's moving at a pace that scientists could never understand. the garage nothing oh something oh my god it's that old man oh no someone's in the house I need to find a place to hide right here will do listen Here we go again.
my. I didn't mean to startle you, young, young lady. Get the fuck out. Please stay calm. My camera to help. I saw someone enter through the garage and thought they might be in danger. You have no right to enter my home without permission. There's no one else here. Listen to me. I saw someone come in here. We're not alone. I checked the cameras. All I saw was you invading my mother's house. You know what I saw? And it wasn't your friend. Someone else came in. Please, I've already asked you to go. Okay. Sorry about this. I must be getting old. I really need to rest. Permanently. Crazy old man. If he comes back here, I swear I'll call the police. Uh, here's a fucking crazy idea. Call them anyways. It's a free service provided to you. Maybe you should just call them anyways. Oh, I don't know. Where's Lenny at, man? This shit's getting old. After that, I don't sleep anymore. I'm gonna watch some TV. Okay. Have a sit. Tonight, we turn our attention to a chilling case that has oh, left the residents Oh, dear God. Here we go. A serial killer, infamously dubbed the Night Stalker, is currently at large. Oh, the Night Stalker. A series of brutal crimes targeting primarily women. Authorities women. report that the suspect I am women. breaks into homes under the cover of darkness. In response to the alarming oh. situation, the police have established a special task force dedicated to apprehending the killer, who has been linked to more than 10 victims to date. In light of these events, residents are urged to ensure their doors are securely locked and to contact the police immediately in case of any emergency. To aid in the investigation, a reward of $5,000 is being offered for any information that leads to the capture of this dangerous... 5k case. for any information? That wraps up tonight's edition of Pineville's Nightly News. Stay safe, and we'll see you tomorrow. I have information. Killer on the loose. That's terrible. Thought the city was quieter. Didn't you say your mom got <laughs> murdered? I, did you think it was quieter? Wow. There's still black and white cartoons on television. Honestly, this TV that we're watching on, I'm surprised, isn't just par primarily in black and white. What are we watching here? Oh my god. Lights are out. Great. Now the power's out. Perfect timing, right? Sure enough. What's going on? Uh, what is the fuse box in the, in the garage? Holy shit, I actually cannot see anything, bro. Wait, how did I even get in here? No, I genuinely cannot see a thing, dude. Wait a second. It feels like the whole world is plotting against me. First, Lenny let me here alone. Then some lunatic shows on my door because of an hostile. Now I get news that there's a murderer on the loose. And right then, the power goes out. If I weren't living it myself, I swear it was straight out of a low-budget movie. And then, what happened? Flashlight activated. There must be a circuit breaker panel outside. Why would it be outside? Why not in the garage? It's not one of the, no, that's, that's, mm. You really think that shit's outside? Jesus. All right. It's just, it's, it's the weather, so. I don't know. Let's see. It must be like around this side door here or something. Oh, there it is. That's strange. Someone definitely sabotaged the panel. Because what do you want to do about it? Hmm. Him again. What's he after this time? Problem? Oh my god. Why are we screaming like that? Bro, let's go to this house. Look, they got lights on. They probably friendly. Let's go. Let's check this. Let's check this place out. Let me bang on the door. Help. What? Fuck. Invisible wall. Who could have foreseen this? Where is he? Wait, who is this guy? Oh, oh my God. He has a cleaver. Okay. Uh. Wait, right, please. I won't hurt you. Die. That's enough. I'm calling police right now. He's banging on the door with a cleaver. We don't. How? How? Damn, I need to hide. Wait. Uh. Here. Turn that flashlight off.
I can't hear anything anymore. I think he's gone. Jesus. Okay. Call the cops. Wait, no, 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 the phone's in here. Call the cops. We don't have power. How are we gonna call the cops? 911. We have to get the fuse box turned back on, but I don't know. It's. I think they ruined it. Now we can call the police before he comes back. Uh, how? How are you gonna do that? Please help me, someone broke into my house. I'm pretty sure he had a knife. Oh, I'm gonna need you to stay calm, man. Can you tell me exactly what happened? I'm gonna need you to suck my nuts if you ever tell me to stay calm again when I'm being chased by a man with a knife. That's what happened. What are you talking about? I don't know. This man knocked on my door asking for help, but something felt wrong. Something about him fell off, so I didn't open the door, but he just stood there. Wouldn't leave. Uh, and then he smashed the door in. I hid, and now it seems like he's gone, but I'm not sure. Okay, now. Send me your address. We'll send a vehicle. Right Here's away. the address. Please hurry. Thank you. Now what? Should I just Ah, right, check the cams, check the cams. 175548. Power soft, dumbass. How did the phone work? What? <laughs> is that on a generator? What is is it? Where's bro at? I feel like I should just wait. Look at that door is wide fucking open. I don't know. I think I should maybe just wait. Upstairs. Morbid curiosity killed the cat. I'm gonna hide in here. Okay. Never mind, I'm not because it does the whole panic thing. I don't know. Here we go. I never thought I'd face a situation this horrifying knowing I could die at any moments far from comforting. I was shaken, decided to stay in the bed till I could stabilize myself a little. Everything was so quiet, I could only hear the sound of the rain. I thought he might have really given up and gone away. But then, but then, what happened? Something terrible. Oh, I'm under the bed. How did I get here? You might be wondering. Oh, we're exiting though. So that's all good. All right. Let's see. Door is still open. Was that? A I heard some. What was it? Shadow of the windows. I don't know. Should I hide? Where's the police at? I've been hiding under the bed. We should have just stayed there. Why did we leave? I was told to. Hmm. Still nobody. Alright. Well, I know there's hiding spots in basically every room. Should I need them? But... I don't know what's going on here. Let me step outside where it's safer. What the fuck is happening? What am I supposed to be doing? Nothing's going on. Everything's just... Alright, some leaves crunching. Sounds to be... Oh my god. So it's the next girl. You gonna run? Hide? What are we playing tonight? Cops are already coming. Cops, I don't hear your sirens face. You're alone and you're mine now. Please don't hurt me. I haven't done anything to you. You're a bad person. You turned me away when I needed help and you don't deserve to live. Now you die. Are she gonna say anything? <laughs> Bitch! Hell yeah, bro. The th I'm so sorry for calling you ugly earlier. I seriously didn't mean it. I mean, you are a little ugly, but... Thank you, brother. I warned you, someone was spying on you, but don't worry. I'm a retired police officer. You're in safe hands. Thank you for saving me. 
Don't worry, I'm your neighbor. I saw you're in danger, so I stepped in to help. Even though you doubted me, I was still my job. I may be retired, but I'm not out the game yet. I'm sorry, I just got scared. All right, did you call the police? Yeah, they're on their way. He won't get up. Stab wound to the upper part of the right lung. I think it'll remain on the floor. I'm gonna call Henry. He's been handling everything with the house. I think I need to let him know. I'm gonna stay here and keep an eye on him. He doesn't seem to be alive, but you never know, right? What? 555726. Uh. <laughs> yeah, thanks, bro. 555726. What the hell is going on, man? Hey Henry, it's Megan. Is everything okay, Megan? I mean, it's already pretty late. Sorry for calling so late, but I was attacked. He tried to kill me. Oh my god, Megan, this is serious. Tell me what happened. Are you safe? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not sure. I'm not the victim. He's in his room. He had a knife. What now? Did you call the police? He's dead. My neighbor Joseph hacked him with a knife. He's on the ground. Henry, are you still there? Megan, did you say your neighbor Joseph saved you? Yeah, he saved me. He's down there right now. That's weird, Megan. You didn't have any neighbors named Joseph. In fact, all your neighbors are out of town. Henry, what the fuck are you talking about? All my neighbors are out of town. How could you first of all know that? Second of all, how could all of my neighbors be out of town, Henry? Are you still there, Megan? up the cleaver I mean he did save me regardless of uh Joseph why did you pick up the knife Joseph you're scared of me I saved your life didn't you say you're my neighbor you lied you're not my neighbor who are you I gave my life to protect and serve others and what did I get absolutely nothing I need something more, something that could make me feel anything again. Tell me, have you ever killed someone? Son of a bitch. Wait a second, Joseph, you're gonna make a fantastic thumbnail, but I also don't really want to die. Wait, wait, where the fuck am I gonna go tonight?
I said about. Please are here. Please are here. Cops are here. Look at them. They're here. Where'd that? Where'd that big boy go? Uh. At least there's a big boy on the run. Big boy on the run. Here I go in slow motion, but there is a big boy on the run. I tell you what, he probably looks like he's running in slow motion too. Oh, what a day. Jesus. Fuck this place. Lenny, we're never getting married. I just need you to know that we're never getting married, Lenny. Five years later. If I'm married to Lenny, I'm going to be so mad. Don't. <laughs> don't play with me. Oh. Nice. We're in the... Where the hell am I? Nice car. What place is this? Whose house is this one? Where is the front of the house? Lenny! Where did you wander? I don't want to go in now. I married Lenny. Oh. Lenny! I married Lenny. No, I married Lenny, bro. No. Oh. Where is he? Lenny, it's cold as shit. It's snowing, you know, stuff. I don't know. It's like. Maybe quit playing games. I can't even wander that far. Well, I don't know where bro's at. But, uh, nope, can't wander that far either. We're stuck in a little box right here. I don't see Lenny. Maybe he froze and died. Oh! Haha, hurry shot. You need sharper eyes than that, Meg. Well, now it's not exactly polite to throw snowballs at folks, is it? Come on, it's our first time seeing snow. Let's have ourselves a snowball fight. You'll never beat me. Well, then, come on. Let's see if you can hit me. Then you son of a bitch. Snowball. Alright. Bring your little ass over here, Lenny. That's one. That's two. I don't lose snowball fights, Lenny. That's four. I'm stuck on a tree. <clears throat> okay, I see you. I respect the game, Lenny. Not that much. I got you stun locked now. You know what that means, Lenny? Probably not. Shit. Come on, man. That's an L, Lenny. L for Lenny. L for Lenny also stands for loss slash loser. All right, I admit it. You got me this time. Yeah, I told you I'm pretty, pretty much unbeatable at snowball throwing. It's freezing out here. Let's head inside and warm up by the fire. Lenny, I just want to say thank you for bringing me here. Ah, I know how much you love me. I promise. I'll never leave you alone again. You left me alone once and a maniac nearly got me killed. Now I'm by your side if anyone tries to come close to you. What are you going to do? I'm gonna let out such a stink even the bravest killer would turn to flee. Haha, <laughs> very funny. Listen, it's been five years, you need to find a way to move on. Every day his face haunts me, feels like a curse. Okay. Joseph James D'Angelo was arrested in 2018 when DNA tests linked him to several crimes. He was then 72 years old. He was tried in mid-2020 for 30 murders and 30 kidnappings to commit robbery. 62 crimes of rape and kidnapping had already been prescribed when he was pleaded guilty, thus avoiding the death penalty, not being sentenced to life in prison. Oh, I forgot this was based on a real story or a true story. 
All right, well, there you go. That was, Jesus, that was long. Bro, I thought this shit was 20 minutes long. I've been sat here for two hours. That was good. Um, pacing was a little slow. I don't know. That was kind of uh, like, that was my main problem with it was the pacing was a little slow. Otherwise, a good game. Uh, story was fun. And uh, it was cute. Look, there we are. That's the first time we get to see us. Yeah, cool. 616's latest game. A long one. Holy shit. Uh, big shout out to 616 for the free Steam key. I appreciate you, bro. Um, yeah, make sure you guys go check the game out. Like I said, I liked it a lot. It was just a little tiny bit slow, some of the basing was. Uh, but otherwise, cool game, bro. I really appreciate uh, you guys watching. So, hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to like and subscribe. And I'll see you tomorrow with another one. Goodbye.